using to uh, facilitate the real growth opportunities is what we call the mobile wall cap. Mobile wall cap is really the industrial tool which is a unique and permanent place. So if you're joining us for just the four days of the Congress, you could join us also for the rest of the year through this tool where you could see that we are trying to develop this new ecosystem. So what are we doing at the CAP? We decided first to select six different uh, areas where we're putting our best efforts. So one is travel and transport, health, tourism, content, and leisure, uh, smart cities or smart stadiums in this case, uh, wallet payment systems and a financial based uh, system, and social projects. So these six verticals is where we are uh, putting our efforts to start to create some uh, projects. So what we're doing here is we're creating three projects. So we're engaging big companies, we're engaging service providers, we're engaging local companies, we're engaging startups in order to create innovative solutions in an, in an open innovation model that could be relevant for the private sector. For example, we created during the Congress the NFC experience. So how you could pay the taxes, how you could open the door of your hotel, and how you could be going to restaurants, how you could enter into the Congress during the Congress life. That was an experience where we were creating the NFC experience during the Congress. We are now working on the personal health folder. Personal health folder is a project where we are involving service providers, uh, SIM, uh, SIM producers, and any, another type of companies, big companies, very well known consultant companies. And we are uh, creating a new um, definition of where you should have your personal identification. So the mobile became your personal identification. And through this personal identification, you could then load anywhere in the world, in any language, your personal health folder. In case you have a problem with a doctor, uh, then you could uh, download this. And it's only yours. So it's a new concept that we are building here. Order Master Stadium. So how the experience in the new stadiums in the world will be for a mobile, uh, for mobile people. So from the moment you enter into the stadium, when you pay your, uh, your snacks, your drinks, or when you want to see or you want to watch um, what is happening on the on the green. So we are created today. We was just launching the Smart Stadium um, project, where we are engaging with 20 different companies worldwide and local to create this new concept of the Smart Stadiums. And as uh, the deputy mayor mentioned, we have the facility which was the Mediatek building. In this building, uh, which is uh, 20, 28 under the square meters, uh, which was nominated the best building in the world, we have uh, plenty of room for entrepreneurs to join us. As the Deputy Mayor said, through the personal growth program, we're subsidizing social security taxes, we're subsidizing local taxes, or we're subsidizing the um, rentals of the office there. So it's a good advantage for people to go there and to establish their headquarters uh, or to establish a, a point of connection in Europe. So this might look complicated, but this is how this is the, the, what we call the M engine. So how we are really developing the ecosystem. So on the on my left hand side, there is the supply where we are identifying the actors. So service providers, local global companies, local companies, startups, and entrepreneurs. That's you. People who are producing solutions for the mobile world. That's you. On the other hand, we have the demand, so the six sectors that we call the competence centers that I just mentioned before. And mobile health, mobile wallet, mobile travel, mobile smart city, M for all, and M content. And on top of that, we have funds. Funds is, uh, is what we're trying to get from different sources, so from business angels, venture capitals, uh, local public funds or European public funds. There is a lot of money coming out from the European uh, age 2020 where uh, a lot of uh, euros will be, uh, will be allocated for developing uh, mobility solutions. So through this connection and we are, and we like, because we're in the middle, we could activate this ecosystem. The way we're going to do is by these, uh, what we call capabilities, M-talent, entrepreneurship, knowledge, marketplace, lab and low. 
So just let me describe for a, just a little bit uh, what is inside each one. So mTalent is the services that we're doing to develop the talent locally in different kind of aspects. So we want to have the most affordable talent uh, locally for the industry. Of course, in Barcelona we have the best business schools, we have one of the best technology uh, universities, we have a lot of talent, but we want to develop and we want to have our talent matching the industry needs. So this is why we are creating this program to really be sure that this is happening. And entrepreneurship, I'll call, uh, I will cover that later on in my next, uh, in my next slide. Let's skip it for a while. Knowledge. Knowledge is about how we are gonna, how we're communicating to the world what we're doing. So which kind of projects we're doing, white papers, the content. It's, it's a lot of speaker of what we're doing inside this uh, app concept. The marketplace. The marketplace is the place, it's a market. It's very easy. It's where supply meets demand. So what we're doing here is we're asking companies from the supply part to present into the demand part the projects that they are working on or the solutions they are working on to make it easier to sell in front of the audience. And MLAP, this is a very, um, it's a very um, sex, so let's say, uh, concept, yeah? It's a combination of urban lab and technology lab where what we are having is uh, we're putting the city as if it was a, a lab where you could test your applications or your technology. We have a technology lab with the latest state-of-the-art technology for mobile networks, where we have a urban lab, and where we have a lot of uh, communities of people that will test, or, or the whole city will become a test bed to assess the, the launch of a certain solution into the market. And then we have the MLO. What we're trying to say here is we're trying to avoid litigations or dispute, and we're trying to set up an arbitration court in Barcelona, an international arbitration court between different countries, technology companies, and service providers. So just let me cover for a little bit the, what we're doing in entrepreneurship. So this is the, the concept of one of the competent, sorry, the capabilities I just mentioned. So entrepreneurship is uh, creating uh, visibility and awareness through the mobile World Congress of Visibility, where we have a special fees for the companies that want to tap it, mobile world capital branding, and the presence of different channels. The funding, as I was describing it before. So we have uh, some uh, venture capital companies in Barcelona which are eager to go for new companies to look for money. We have also business angels, uh, activities in Barcelona, and we have so many that we're exporting many, some of them into here, into San Francisco. And, uh, we have also funds from different initiatives. We have a special incentive from fiscal point of view. From the incubation and acceleration program, so Barcelona Activa is running this part of the program. We have mentorship and oversee programs, acceleration programs, incubation programs in the immediate, uh, and we have bootcamp programs. So it's something to really develop the incubation and acceleration a part of the mobile world capital. Events and networking, again, it's a place where market meets demand uh, or offer meets demand and we are uh, creating calls and tournaments uh, linked to our M programs, linked to the health, wallet, and all these kind of concepts. Uh, we have also thematic events, panels, hackathons, we're thinking about creating different initiatives to improve all these uh, activities. And uh, we have also landing services as described before, so if any company wants to land there, we want to make it their life easy. In the easier in the terms of uh, landing and welcome back, legal services, legal assessments, uh, business assessment, all of that. And of course, we have the facilities related to the, to the media deal. So we know that uh, maybe for you, uh, the Spanish economy is not looking very well, but uh, the worst is behind us. And uh, with this kind of uh, activities we're doing and trying to promote, we are really setting uh, the expectation for a bright new future uh, in Barcelona in terms of mobility. If you one more, and just uh, to finalize, so what's next? You've been uh, maybe four or five of you have been in the conference last year. I hope that most of you will be next year there. But if you wanna join us, simply it's 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 uh, very simple. Just be in touch with us, and we'll try to help you uh, increasing your uh, your uh, awareness developing your uh, model of the market through the mobile 
will lock in the real mobile or low capital ecosystem. Okay, I think that's it. Now's your turn. If it works.